part-time folks. They, these are the folks who are uh, worked on the DPW, seasonal laborers doing trash picking. Work. They have struggled for a significant period of time filling some of those. And we do think that pay is part of that. I think at some point they were $9, $11, and we were having trouble getting anybody to apply for those positions. Yep. Um, same with uh, folks to assist in the rec department for the summer with assistance of parks maintenance and that type of thing. So we had a global discussion about what should that number be? You can go to McDonald's and, and work for $15. So we, with some of those positions, we recommended and we put in the budget that they go to $14 is sort of our base minimum there for those types of positions. There are a couple others there that may be smaller, but generally that's the number we're recommending. Um, and we've made those adjustments within this budget. I would recommend that we do that. We need to start getting more people in public works in the summer to assist. We need to have more assistance uh, dealing with some of these issues for the parks to be much more effective with some of the great work that's been done to upgrade them. I agree with that. I agree. Uh, we can wait for Rusty and then. Um, yeah, I agree. It's okay, so the chart there, it just breaks down the number of hours that were in the budget, all the positions, what they're currently being paid for, according to the 17 budget, and then right. the increase for the 18. That's kind of your breakdown. So you guys can see it all right there instead of yep. looking across the budgets. Yeah. But to be clear, these are true part-time, non-union positions, seasonal employees, most of them. Yeah. They're all seasonal for this thing here. Yep. 